I've never recruited a player. Basketball coach Stan Kovaleski told Fox 8 Wednesday Guilford County Schools will not renew his contract next year. An investigation found two basketball players on his team were ineligible to play because they were not going to their home school. I'm a basketball coach. Uh, my job is to coach the kids that are deemed eligible to play for us and not to go around policing where, you know, Johnny and Joey and Jimmy live. In December 2007, the athletic director at Northwest Guilford High School emailed his principal about concerns of recruiting at Northern. John Hughes's email reads, I am convinced that Stan Kovaleski, non-faculty head coach at Northern, is actively recruiting and enrolling students at Northern who are not in the Northern attendance zone. The fact is, he is a very wealthy man who has the means to rent and provide housing addresses and transportation to several of his players. Two days later, the school superintendent at the time, Dr. Terry Greer, started an investigation. In January of 2008, Greer wrote in an email the district found no violations. The next day, school board member Darlene Garrett sent an email to other school board members saying she wanted names and addresses of student athletes. In August, Coach K filed a defamation lawsuit against Northwest's athletic director because he says Hughes' email is not true. And if you have good coaches and you have good programs and your son or daughter play a particular sport, you know, parents are going to move their kids to that particular school. It happens across the state and across the country. Uh, and if people want to call that recruiting, I call it attracting. Northwest Guilford's athletic director John Hughes says he can't comment because of the lawsuit. We called lawyers for both sides. Coach K's lawyer says they settled the defamation suit last fall on confidential terms.